Unraveling the heat. Understanding sweltering humidity. Hello and welcome to our English language learning journey. Today, we're diving into a phrase that perfectly captures the essence of a hot, sticky summer day. Sweltering humidity. This phrase is not just about the weather. It's about the experience of the weather. Let's explore what each word means and how they come together to describe a specific feeling. We hope this video makes your English learning experience a bit cooler. Sweltering and humidity are two words that paint a vivid picture when used together. Sweltering is an adjective that describes extremely hot temperatures, the kind that makes you feel like you're melting. On its own, humidity refers to the amount of water vapor in the air. High humidity means the air is full of moisture, making it feel heavy and damp. When we say sweltering humidity, we're talking about an intense combination of heat and moisture in the air, creating an overwhelmingly hot and sticky atmosphere. Sweltering humidity is more than just a weather report. It affects everything from our physical comfort to our daily activities. In conditions of sweltering humidity, physical discomfort is significant. It can feel almost impossible to cool down because sweat doesn't evaporate easily from your skin. Energy levels may drop, making you feel lethargic or too tired to be active. It can affect mood, sometimes making people feel irritable or less patient than usual. Understanding this phrase can help you describe summer experiences in certain climates, especially in tropical regions or during heat waves in temperate zones. This phrase is a great example of how English uses descriptive language to combine sensations and conditions into a single, powerful expression. Here are a few examples of how you can use sweltering humidity in sentences. I couldn't go for my run today. The sweltering humidity made it too difficult to breathe outside. The sweltering humidity of July makes the city feel like a sauna. Despite the sweltering humidity, we decided to have our picnic indoors. Using phrases like this in your English conversations can help you convey not just information, but also the feeling or experience behind that information. Understanding and using phrases like sweltering humidity can add depth and vividness to your English communication, especially when talking about the weather or your environment. We hope this exploration helps you feel more comfortable and expressive in your English language journey. Remember, every phrase you learn opens up new ways to connect and share your experiences. Stay cool and see you in our next video.